St. Peter's is known for a wholesome development of the child. We believe in, uh, in wholesome growth of the child. You realize that our students have a strong talent and the St. Peter's has given the opportunity through its strong talent nurturing programs and therefore we are proud of the successes we have had. St. Peter's Boys uh, Mumias High School has offered me the space, the art room. We have an art teacher, Madam Mumia, who nurtures us, corrects our mistakes, teaches us on how to better our skills in all ways possible. We select students uh, at Form 1. Once we get the Form 1s, we have a session with them, one or two. We give them some practicals and then from there we can identify the talents. St. Peter's Mumias has helped me so much whereby it has enabled me to save my talent through my art teacher, Madam Mumia, who has helped me since from one and now I'm a candidate uh, sitting for the exam this year. When I joined St. Peter's in Mumias Boys High School in Form 1, that's when I realized that I have talent, a hidden talent uh, in art. After we identify the talent, we take the students into the art room and then we have a one-on-one -on -one session where one, we look at the ability of the students, what can they do, what can they do, then their interest, because art we need talent, we need the interest and also we need the ability to do something. So after maybe like four or five sessions in a week's time, we can tell if this student is really fit to, to take art and design as a subject in this school. I'm hoping in the next five years that we, we shall have maybe two streams that is around 100 students taking art. We shall have art respected not even just in St. Peter's but even the outside society that we are just as equal as what the other subjects are given the chances so that the students taking art will not feel uh, wasting the time in the art room, but they shall see that they are making their careers. We want to encourage our parents because personally, I was privileged to grow with a father who was an artist, but my mother never liked it. Say something, it really was not easy for me. So we want to encourage even the other parents that you can be an artist and you can still provide. Uh, I remember the time when I was working through this school and then I came to this point at a design classroom and then I saw people were making beautiful things. Uh, I was amazed. Actually, that's when uh, I met Madame Mumia, who is our teacher, the one who has guided us until now. I appreciate her so much. Art is real, art pays, art is there, it is within us. Most of us are born with it, so I urge parents to allow their children to be nurtured. If there's any talent, let's not kill it. Because not all of us are talented in science and all that. There's, all, there's that artist who needs to change the world, who needs to change the, the nature, who needs to change the beauty of where we live in. So let's allow our, our, our children to go through art and we'll make the world a better place. My name is Clinton Shina. Uh, and I love art with all my heart. Not just my heart, but I have passion in it just because of St. Peter's. I love St. Peter's. One, it has a beautiful art room, materials, tools, and the best teacher in Kenya. If not the best, one of the best. Thank you, Madam Mumia, for everything you've done, nurturing our talents, uh, helping us through thick and thin, and now, we, as we are sitting for KCSC, we, will, we know that your help will not go unrewarded. Thank you.